we doing, guys? Just doing a little fun stuff here on the stage, so check it out. show going on this uh, Sunday. So we're off the stage. It's the third year now I've been doing it and uh, I've only I've only played original songs in it and um, it's gotten me pretty pretty far and it's got me a lot more comfortable with playing in front of people which has always been a anxiety filled mess for me but um, especially the older I get and the more I write because it's like it's not just doing a cover of a song like you can butcher the song that's it's not that big of a deal, but if you write a song and uh, you share it with the world and then they don't like it, that's just, that is just 
total anxiety for me. So anyways, uh, yeah, it's the third year I've been doing it, Rock the Stage, and uh, I just love everybody that's involved with it. They're just very awesome people, and they uh, really support each other, and it's it's a great thing to see, and it's a great thing to be a part of. So, um, yeah, I'm pretty excited for this Sunday. But uh, this one uh, is called Demons, and I hope you like it. Demons. And those are the two audition songs, Making Memories and Demons, I auditioned with this year. And uh, I made it to the semifinals. And I was playing at the ranch, which is uh, pretty dope. Like, I have a lot of 
a lot of bands that I've liked over the years have played there. So it's kind of cool to hopefully get some of that that backstage juju from all those uh, musicians and everybody, artists. And uh, I'm really looking forward to it. So, uh, yeah, I just wanted to hop on here and do a couple songs for you and, you know, hopefully get you guys in the mood to go on out and watch a show. So, uh, there's 24, 24 artists supposed to be playing and uh, it's judged like like an American Idol or like The Voice or something. And, uh, yeah, I mean, it's, it's pretty informative, if anything else. And uh, for me, it's more of like... A, it's a it's a battle within me to get up and do these things that my head tells me that I'm not good enough or anything like that. So so yeah. Um, anyways, it's it's a huge it's a huge step in the musical direction for me. So I'm like super appreciative of the chances and the opportunity that these guys give me. Last year. Last year, uh, my song, so we had the hurricane last year, and it's kind of a cool story. After the hurricane, uh, a lot of a lot of musicians and everybody lost their job because the beach just washed away down in Fort Myers. So um, last year was a benefit to all the musicians and everything, but uh, the first year and this year is more along the lines I think of like uh, kids that can't afford instruments and, and um, want a musical career or you know some sort of musical destination in their in their life because they're talented and um, you know it, it kind of benefits kids that don't have that opportunity to get into music or buy instruments or, or things like that you know and um, that's also another cool reason why I do it but um Last year, the hurricane came, and after the hurricane, I, I, I wrote a song about the hurricane. So, um, and it got me, <laughs> it got me on the news. Bob Tabarini and Doug, the, the School of Rock founder, um, with the show last year, it, they saw how it, you know, affected the crowd playing that song that was the first time I played it in front of anybody and uh the crowd was like singing along and like participating in the song it was really cool uh to see that come together in front of me from a song I wrote and uh it had such a impact on the crowd they got me on the news I played with a full band on the news it was amazing but um like shout out to you guys that was way cool that was a huge uh huge thing for me in my life and I'll never forget that experience so uh anyways I'm gonna I, I feel like I should do that song now so here's her can't Southwest Florida Pride. Come on. It sounds like there's a war going on outside. Got explosions up on a highway. Now the power's out. That wind is whipping.
but yeah, that was Hurricane, and uh, I was uh, lucky enough to get all the songs you heard in, in the studio at House of Mortal down in Fort Myers, which is freaking awesome dudes. I love those guys. I'm going to be uh, in there here soon, probably after this uh, concert and getting a couple more done. Uh, but um, the last one, I got I got four that are out right now. Uh, I got Making Memories, I got Demons, I got Hurricane, and um, this one, this next one's going to be Eyes on the Prize. You can, you can get all the songs uh, on Amazon, on Spotify, on Apple Music, all, all that stuff. So um, this one's going to be Eyes on the Prize. just recorded uh, not in the studio yet but I just made a video and it's called be the light and it's a it's a song I'm gonna take it to the studio here uh, in the upcoming weeks it might be the turn of the year might be before I don't know yet but uh yeah this one's uh, called be the light and I really like this song and I really enjoy it and I'm pretty sure that this is gonna be my choice for semifinals so uh, Hopefully you guys uh, come out and sing along with me, and yeah, hopefully I can make it to the finals. Here it is, Be The Light. Got it all. When 
when you're feeling broke and you can't pick up your heart. Just know you're not alone. Everyone's got scars, and if your tears fall down, doesn't mean you're not a superstar. I'll never let them steal your pride. We are. It's okay to be afraid for all overcoming fears. Your dreams get delayed and all hope seems to disappear. Just know it'll be okay. Time will dry your tears. Darkness is only temporary. That sunshine will surely be a peer. Don't ever let them steal your pride. We all wrong. That was Be The Light. I'm, I'm going to feature that one on uh, the semifinals. And hopefully you guys made it this far. And uh, thanks for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed that. And uh, I'll hopefully see you all soon. All right? Keep rocking. Thanks for watching.